I'm Mary Kitchen. Apparently, George Clooney has a system. He says one for them and one for me. That is, one for the big studios and one for himself. Tonight, at the premiere of Michael Clayton, it was definitely one for George. Well, this is, you know, it's not really one for them. It's usually one for them and then three for me is what you try to do. You try to buy yourself a couple of smaller films. And it's not even that, you know, if the sellouts are doing the Oceans films, then I'm very pleased to do those, you know. No, but I'm saying if that's if that's the idea, in general, you're just trying to do films that you're really proud of along the way and try to build up a resume. Here, okay, you know? this this film brings up a lot of big, fairly big moral questions: money versus ethics. Mm -hmm. What will the audience go away um, thinking? What well, you know, with any luck at all, the film is really about these people, these individuals, and you could have done it in a hospital or you could have done it in government, and it happens to be in corporate world. There's we have a long history of of um, of uh, films about corruption, you know, for a long period of time. So with any luck, it's just, it always continually brings up the discussion, which we always like. Michael Clayton was written and directed by Tony Gilroy, writer of the Bourne trilogy. It asks a lot of, uh, a lot of very human, very small questions about the decisions that people make. It's very much, it's sort of a thriller that's very deeply involved in the moments that people make the decisions about what they decide to do. Um, and that's what interests me most. And I've written lots of other thrillers that have to do with a lot of external forces. And you want to take the same energy of that. And this time I really wanted to look at the moment where people make the decisions, the moment where they decide to do one very small thing that leads to uh, a, a much larger danger and problem. I just think it has at its heart this question about, you know, there's these inhuman acts that we see perpetrated every day and we read about them and we hear about them. And, and, and the people who are perpetrating them are humans and they maybe go home to their kids and they maybe go home and they kiss their husbands and wives and they're probably really nice to their sisters and brothers. But they, they slip just very incrementally into doing these terrible things and uh, we just have to watch out, you know, make sure that you're listening to your own heart. Tell me, what are you gonna do to celebrate tonight? I, well, you know, I just got here, so I don't know. I'm gonna probably wander around and drink. That's my MO. From the Visa Screening Room at the Toronto International Film Festival, I'm Mary Kitchen for Red Carpet Diary.